Alright, here's a look at the smart cat feeder that I've put together. Some people have been asking about it. It's just a, a wood box that I built. Um, nothing really fancy or crazy there. Just sanded it, um, stained it, finished it with some polyurethane to give it kind of a, a nice look to it. And then those are some pots that my wife spun by hand uh, that the cats eat out of. Got my dot sitting up here. Just gonna move this guy for a second. And then we got a little piano hinge. Let me take a look inside. I've got a Raspberry Pi 3. Uh, just using the input output pins. Pretty uh, standard stuff, I guess. So this connects to two bins here. These are just cereal dispensers. Um, so the Raspberry Pi is connected to these servos. These are continuously rotational servos, I think is the, the term for it. So what will happen is when the Raspberry Pi runs a script that uses pulse width modulation to turn on these servos, and it will rotate each of these servos for about a second or so. And then there are these little rubber flaps inside of it. It's a cereal dispenser, so it will dispense the cereal, not the cereal, the cat food uh, for the cats. So let's put this back up here, and then if we take a look at my tablet, I've got smart things, and I used a URI switch. Basically, it's a virtual um, URI button, I guess. So the way that it works is you just give it a name, and then configure it with the IP address. That's the IP address of the Pi, and then this is the let it focus there. That's the path of the script. So what happens is when you push this button, it goes to this IP address and runs that PHP script. And within that PHP script, basically all it does is it executes a Python script. And it's, it's pretty easy. I knew basically nothing about programming before I got this started and I learned quite a bit along the way. So if we just press this button here, it kind of all goes everywhere, but it rotates the servos, um, which is what dispenses the food. And then the best part of it is, since it's a SmartThings virtual button, Alexa, turn on the cat feeder. So when I talk to Alexa, all she's doing is talking to SmartThings and pushing a virtual button, which feeds the cats. So there it is.